Well, I think it was a short and crisp budget speech, which is keeping with the message they want to give. They have not introduced any new taxes or done any changes in a manner that would upset. They have kept a certain stability aspect in place. Second is they have said they will continue to spend on infrastructure as well as welfare programs, which are all very necessary, which they have been doing, doing very well over the last few years. And despite the fact that we had COVID and so many disturbances due to war, supply chain breaks up, India has done well with their policies. And they continue to push that in, in, the, in the direction of a developed India by 2047. So from that point of view, they have managed to keep up that and given us the assurance that they will continue to do the spend on infrastructure. They will continue to do something for improvement of women's participation in things. And that they are going to do necessary reforms that are required to improve the investment climate so the, so the private investment also comes forth. I think this is very well what they have suggested. Fiscal deficit is a very important aspect of stability because if the fiscal deficit goes out of hand, all issues become very unclear and therefore hesitancy it steps in in the investment. For which they are bringing it down and they are bringing it down to the extent that they can. Uh, and I think that's a good signal. Instead of going more than what we already were, they are bringing it down but not to the extent that we, we wanted it earlier. Second is, some of this uh, fiscal deficit is coming as a result of our capex spending. And as long as it is going into capex, it doesn't really matter that much.